So, what do we have to take off for this? I have to remember how these things go on. Like that. <laughs> This pulls forward as soon as I can get my grubby fingers in it. This one also does pull forward, it seems. I don't think this goes up. I'm concerned it goes up. Ah. Aha. Ah. Ah. <laughs> success, success, success. Got that. So then we pull out these two. Hmm. Um. My tripod. And I'll get my stool so I can sit down while I do this because why not? It's at that level. Alright, so we're taking off the wood latch. Everybody with their S4s. Oh my god. Everybody with their S4 questions on the Reddit. Okay. All right, so to get this hood, lat off, the hood latch off, let's go ahead and take these two out, see where that gets us. I'm pretty sure we got to take the third one off too. Get myself a little bit more working room. And by working room, I mean... Yes, I've seen the seven days advertisement. It's pretty cool. Not very, it's kind of accurate, not super accurate, but it's pretty good. I like it that they're advertising now. Put it that way. I don't like that it doesn't have any gameplay in it. That seems kind of silly. But whatever's. Get this bottom one out. Oh, it's a different size. Of course. Of course, of course. A horse is a horse. You know what we can do? Classic method of how to get stuff off. Just to look at our new part. So, here's a new part. So we do have to get that bottom one off. And it looks like, once we get that off, all we gotta do is haul this cable over, unplug it, and then move over the hood pull. Hood pull. And uh, that will be pretty much it. Got the spring on it, got the switch. For when it closes. Cool. But we just gotta get this bottom bolt off, which is that size. What are you doing to that Mercedes? All right, so now we get the... Now what? A seatbelt buckle? Pull off. Seat, lat, or the cable. Now we gotta follow the cable for the other end of this. Which goes... Does this one come with new clips all the way? Yes, it does, so I can just rip off the clips. Thank God for that. These clips just, it all goes down the back. Oh, okay, I see where it goes. It goes right here. 
This is the good latch that I'm pulling apart. And just to confirm, take the new one. And Gombert. Same one. So, we can pull this out of here. Get that off there. Ta da! Ah, damn it. Whew, I about sat down on no seat. And you guys would have laughed and laughed, and I wouldn't have laughed. So close. So close to just sh wiggling out. Just swiggle out. Swiggle. Swiggle. There we go. Ah. Damn it. Oh well. You'll get to see me put the new one in. So yeah, let's have a look real quick. Little messed up. Not messed up. Little messed up. Not messed up. Not supposed to be all smashed up like that. Put the cord through. I have said day three without injury. It's an amazing feat, especially for me. I went in so much easier. Why you do this? Why you do this? Okay, let's go ahead and bolt it down. So they have squares in the holes for the hood latch because we need to be able to adjust it as necessary to appropriately accommodate the hood. So while we're testing it, we're going to probably leave this hood strap or something. I need to leave something there so that way in case it gets stuck, we're not screwed. So first we'll start with it as high as we can get it to go. About right there. And we'll just start adjusting it down as we get closer to success. Set bolt. Right, and the other two. Got the wrench up so I don't hit the car. <laughs> Let's hook up our wood latch cable on the back side here. This pretty much this just presses in like so, and then this loops around that to make sure it doesn't fall off. It doesn't fall off. And this we run around and hook up over here. So do we want it to go around? AC, so let me plug in all the particular cords that go into there. Mm. Damn it. Let's 
trying to get the clips into position as best I can, not being able to see anything. I gotta move this clip down a little bit. Move the clip down a smidge, that way it'll actually get into its hole. Oh, that's the worst feeling ever. Like when you uh, when you go to feel something, or to, I went to to put the the clip in, and the back of my nail rubbed against something sharp, so you just feel it kind of scrape against your nail, and it's just like oh, 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 oh. it just feels gross. You know what I mean? Like reverse nails on the chalkboard. Why, thank you! Uh, tiny... I didn't see the rest of it, I'm sorry. Also, you could hear all that noise. There's it. There it is. Oh, I lost it. Thank you for the follow. Ah. Get in there! Ah, finger step. Get in the hole, you bastard. Damn it. It won't get in the hole. There we go. Jesus, now it did. And lastly, this one right here. Do do there. Okay, good. Now we need the latch, the pull. This is this is always very interesting. Although this does not seem correct. I mean, this kind of is correct, but kind of not at the same time. I don't think this should have this. Hmm. that's smushed so this is hard because what you got to do with this is you gotta spread it you gotta spread these over these over this pin here and so basically you just gotta double its size double its fun double its peppermint gum and is this the right hood latch the or the correct tongue, tongue. Because it's got this adapter, this thing on it, which. Oh, 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 oh. Is it in the grill? Oh, yeah, it is. Herp a derp a derp. I can put the grill on before I put this on. Or I can pop this one off. Yeah, I'm gonna pop this one. I'm gonna pop this one out and new one in it. Never mind. I'm a derpy derp. I'm gonna herp a derp a derp a derp. derp. So it goes like so, which we have to put this through here. I lied. I forgot the grill was off. <laughs> What's up, Tiny Connor? That's the, what the name was. Got any uh, stoner and uh, TLG? If you guys could be so kind as to let me know, like poke me or whatever, if there are any questions in the chat that I'm missing, or just keep repeating them until I answer them, like the like the window. No, that's trying to answer Reddit questions and and uh, fix cars and 
help my boss. And <laughs> it's getting chaotic, but hey, it's awesome. I love it. This is fun. It's going to get to the point soon where, like I uh, like I originally planned, hi pipe. Uh, when I start getting a lot of people in here, that where it comes to answering questions, I'm gonna have to make it to where you gotta be a sub to be get like, you know, on the spot to answer questions. The rest of the time, it's just kind of at my convenience, and I can. Or, you know, on Discord or something like that. God, I hate doing this because it feels like you're going to snap it in half. There's no good way of doing this otherwise. I guess we just got to spread it around. And it broke. God damn it. Tab broke. There's no other good way of putting that on. Yes. It is actually for as smashed up as that front end is, and this thing's not busted. Although I don't know how to get the, I know how to get the thing over it. We'll just get it on first. Let's put it on like this. Why gold my Midas? Is that gold Midas? <sighs> okay, let's get this thing on. This thing is just, this one might actually work better because it's kind of oily. So it's a little flexible. Get on there, get on. Yes, we got one side. We got both sides. Yes, boys, we did it. We did it. The only happenstance is that we have to kind of. There. So now we do this. Takes finesse. Take this through here. Damn it, get there. I did it the other way. Go, you bastard. Yeah, y'all. Look at all the success we're having. Got that. Put these in. Get the grill the rest of the way on. Click. 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 Grill's on. Now we need to put that piece on, which we have two options. Let's try the old one first, wherever it may be. All right, so this. What I've done for these, I think it goes on that way. Yeah, uh, I do these to get them off of when I do timing belts. I will uh, clip the bottom piece like this, clip it right in the bottom, and then use that to slip it over. This one might be too stiff. Doesn't have enough oil on it from being old as dirt. Aha! There you go. And I did it upside down. <laughs> Great. Oh well. Ta da! Now, I get to take this rope off. Try and figure this out. I got the hood latch on there. So, this is kind of like the prey method shut the hood and hope that you don't close the. Doesn't all break. Flaps or something like that. First thing we'll check is the. I gotta get this damn rope off. Because they got this thing all tied up here. I don't wanna cut their perfectly nice rope. I got the. The Colonel's had a good one on it, shockingly. Oh, my wife's texting me. Inevitably. There. Take off that. Now, let's shut and pray. First thing we're going to do is. Bring it down easy. 
gonna ease onto the latch. Make sure this works. Yep. Open it. Let's hook. Let's see how it lines up. Looks like it lines up really well. Really hard to see in there. But one thing I'm gonna do before we do this, we're gonna do the test method of take this. On, all the way in. <sighs> My thumb isn't strong enough. Um, let's use our 90 degree one. Here is my. There it is. Okay. All right, let's pull it from inside the car. Good. It opened. So we know that the switch will work when it's closed, and it'll pull. I don't know if you saw anything, but I could hear the distinct thunk. So, now we check to see if the hood will line up. Hold your prayers. Hood's on. Sticking up a little bit on um, one side. Sticking up over here. Anyway. Oh, kicked out my thing. Boo. All right, so let's. Well, shit. I was going to say, let's lower it a little bit, but we need to take the entire grill back off. We gotta do what we gotta do to get this right. We can just do it this way. And we can just take our wrench, simply loosen them slightly. I'm stuck on the rope on my stool. So, just loosen this a little bit, loosen this a little bit, and then lastly, loosen the bottom one a little bit, which is a different size. Gotta loosen the top ones a little bit more. Now let's take our tiny hammer. Oop. There. Moved it down just a pinch. Also, that was the brass hammer. Good and tight. Good and tight. Good and tight. Good and tight. Oh, Jason gets to do the seat. I'm so jealous. You guys would have liked that, taking out the seat, doing the seatbelt buckle. But oh well. We'll get more. Don't worry, we'll get more. There will be more seats in the future. To which you and I will be privy to their repair. Amps. All right, let's check it again. Didn't loosen up anything back here. Good. Boop. It's pretty much the same. So it's not hood latch related. And like this looks good. It's just on this side. I think it's got a little bit of body damage or has previously had some body damage that they have repaired possibly. So 
We are good. It will hold the hood. And that's what they're going for. Check it one more time. Make sure we can open it. Hey-oh! Ta-da!